Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to show you how to set up Visual Studio Code IDE with Minji W compiler. You can install other IDE also like DC++, Code Lite and Code Blocks and other also. But I will teach you how to install VS Code and Minji W compiler. I will teach you how to install from where we can install so that you can write your first C++ and C program easily. Let's get started. First, open, open the browser. Type Visual Studio Code download. Here, go to the official website by Visual Studio Code. Click on it. Here, you will see a button, download button. Click on this button. The file is getting added for download. It is downloading now. Wait until there. Now, the file is downloaded. Click on it. After that, you will pop the pop up came. Read the license agreement. Click on I accept the agreement. Then click on next. Click on next. You can change the location of the file path. I will keep it as it is. If you want to change, go here and change the file location. Then click on next. Click on next. Here, yeah, you have to make sure that the had to path is checked or not. It is very, very important. This is must be checked. If you want a desktop icon, check, check on it. Then click on next, click on install. It is installing now. Wait until it install. Click on finish. After that VS code is installed now. Then again go to the browser and type MinGW. Here you will get this link by source force. Click on it. Here you will see a download button with green color. Click on this. It is downloading. Wait for a bit. It is downloaded now. Go here. Click on it. Here, click on install. Keep it as it is. Click on continue. It will take some amount of time based on your internet connectivity. Wait until there.
download is completed now click on continue then here you have to see in basic setup these packages are there here for MinGW developer toolkit click here and mark for installation same for base also mark for installation after that MinGW32 GCC G++ this also mark for installation click MinGW32 GCC OBJC for marks for installation then after this go to installation click for apply changes click apply wait until it done It is showing all changes were applied successfully. You may close this now. Close now. Then all the boxes we marked for installation are green now. Close this also. After installation, go to the folder. Here where you store saved. I saved in C drive. Here you will find a MinGW compile folder. Click on it. Open the bin folder. Here go here and copy the path. Control C. I will copy this path. Then close this. 
Now I will copy this bin path because we need it for environmental variables. In search bar, go type environment variables. Open. Click here environment variables. Here go to the path. Here right here. Double click it. Here click on new. Paste the path. Click OK. Received here. Click OK. Close this here. Then open command prompt. Here to check for C version, C compiler. Type gcc space hyphen hyphen version. You will find it right here. gcc min gw gcc 6.3 0.1 For checking C++ compiler, type g++ space hyphen hyphen version. Enter. You found here. C++. Now open VS Code. Here on the left side bar go to extension or you can press Ctrl Shift X. Go here and type for C++ or C or C++. Here installed by the Microsoft. It is by Microsoft install it. You have to install the extension provided by the Microsoft. It is installing. Then type code runner. Install this also. Click on trust and publish installer. By installing code runner, it make running code easier for C and C++. Close this. Close this also. Go here, file, new file, type hello.c. Create a file, then write a simple C program. Writing a simple C program to demonstrate you. Save this file. After you can go here and click the run button or you can right click and here you can find run code it is executed we can also write an c++ program i will show you here new file save it as world dot cpp save write a c program as tag include 
C++ program sorry IO stream Both C and C++ are similar, they have little bit difference in their syntax. Here we write C out instead of printf. Handle moves the cursor to the next line. Save this file, right click run or you can press this button. Here you see the word cpp file is run and printed hello world. That's it guys, we have set up VS code with MinGWL compiler run and we run our first C and C++ program. If you found this video helpful, please do like, share and subscribe for more coding tutorials and thank you guys.